the Murfreesboro Municipal Airport is continuing to upgrade their facilities, looking toward the future. And they're doing it with grants to help offset the costs. In 2020, a new state-of-the-art terminal was constructed to replace one that was built in 1952. This is uh, Hangar 1, or the replacement of an old hangar that was out here. Originally, one of the original hangars that was at the Murfreesboro Airport, affectionately known as the Quonset Hut, is, uh, was removed and uh, this place was, uh, this building facility was put in its place. Uh, it's moved back a little bit from the main ramp and the runway, uh, giving us a lot more area for parking aircraft and everything in front of this hangar. We're going from around uh, 10,000 square feet or less than 10,000 square feet to over 19,000 square feet in, in uh, office space, shop space, and hangar space. So a, a big change. Well, this is a city-owned building that we are going to lease to a tenant, and uh, it was part of a, uh, a grant process that we went through with the Tennessee Division of Aeronautics, which is part of the Tennessee Department of Transportation. And it was a, a grant that uh, airports uh, had to apply for to get economic airport economic development money. So uh, a lot of our funds that are used for airport improvements are really, really geared towards pavement, uh, maintenance and, and things like that. We also needed some funding for economic development for companies that want to come into Tennessee for expansion of companies that are already working. This grant uh, was approved for Murfreesboro to build this hangar. It's uh, two million dollars that the state gave us and then another 2.5 or so that the city had to provide to uh, complete this project. So what you're seeing here today is, is really the, the bay, which is around 16,000 feet. It's four bays. Well, we can put up a wall and lease out one of these bays to a private individual or somebody else or another company, and it, it gives us that ability to adjust where a big box hanger would not allow us to separate customers or uses or anything like that. It continues to add what we've already created with the terminal and business center. It adds to this uh, terminal campus area. We're really representing now Murfreesboro and where it's coming along with business oriented um, a mindset, uh, a attracting companies here to Murfreesboro. This is a, a very attractive building inside and out. Businesses that, that come in and visit a community often fly around the country to do quick looks at the community that they're interested in. First impression is so important. So when they come into our terminal now, when they see these types of facilities, they see a, 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 an airport that is active, uh, that represents the community and it represents the community well.